Raiders exclusive report, defense dominates the point, securing holiday win. Greetings, Raiders Nation! In a cold Christmas showdown in Kansas City, our beloved Silver and Black triumphed with a hard-fought 20-14 victory over the Chiefs. But before all the details leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you are a true Raiders fan. The Raiders defense set the tone from the start, keeping the Chiefs at bay in the first quarter, denying first downs and holding them to a net passing loss of minus 18 yards. Meanwhile, they sacked Patrick Mahomes twice. The quarter ended with a Raiders field goal, giving them a 3-0 lead. As the temperature dropped, the action heated up in the second quarter, with the Chiefs scoring their first touchdown to take a 7-3 lead. But wait, there's more. The Raiders once again showed off their defensive prowess. Following a Raiders punt that beat the Chiefs at their own 13-yard line, Isaiah Pacheco mismanaged the snap, allowing Bilal Nichols to catch it and return it 8 yards for a touchdown. Interim coach Antonio Pierce praised the team's effort, stating, next man up mentality. Football team. On the Chiefs' next play, Jack Jones intercepted Mahomes, running 33 yards into the end zone for back-to-back -back defensive touchdowns in 7 seconds. This marked the first time in franchise history that the Raiders scored multiple non-offensive touchdowns in consecutive games. With five defensive touchdowns in 2023, the Raiders lead the NFL in this category, achieving the most by the team in a single season since 2000. Malcolm Koontz continued his stellar performance, recording three sacks against Mahomes, making him the only player to sack the Chiefs' QB three times in a single game. Malcolm is really making a name for himself, Pierce said. It's good to see the effort and the fight against many things. I ask them to do whatever it takes and by all means just find a way to do it. A third-quarter field goal sealed the deal, as the Raiders secured their second consecutive win against AFC West foes. The last time the Raiders achieved this feat was in Weeks 9 and 10 of the 2020 season, defeating the Chargers and then the Broncos. The Silver and Black hit the road again next week for the final road game of the regular season against the Indianapolis Colts on December 31st. Tell me Raiders fans what you have to say about this news leave your opinion here, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, but I will be back later to update you with the latest Raiders news.